Hello folks, and here we are again today with a sort of rookie's guide to defeating some of these bosses. You might find it a bit hard uh, defeating with the melee weapons, so we're using some long range weapons. And in this video it's the bow, so uh, as you can see there, we walk down to down the side to this ledge. I've got some magic as well. I started off with some magic, but I think the bow uh, took off more energy so I uh, did switch to the bow but you can use magic or the bow um, as you can see we're just like we've um, locked in so all we got to do is I like, walk backwards and forwards hit the leech monger you know, fire those balls of leeches um, and just step out of the way in fact I think you can just like if you you can actually sort of peer over the ledge at a certain point and you won't get hit by those uh, leeches so you can probably just stay there and fire away so I suppose you could say this is a cheese in the boss here, the leechmonger. Um, I tried uh, beating him with a melee attack with a sword, but I wasn't very good. So um, being a rookie, and I'm imagining that anybody watching this video is probably a rookie like me as well. Um, I got frustrated and couldn't do the melee attack, so uh, we can resort to this long range attack. They say either using magic or the longbow, so I preferred the longbow. I can't remember if I scaled up my bow at this stage. But uh, this, uh, with the leechmonger, I'm still getting used to the game, really. And uh, since defeating the leechmonger, I've found the wonders of the thief ring, and they come handy uh, with some of the harder bosses, which I'll uh, um, explain in some future videos. Um, after this boss, I went back to the Tower Knight and kind of cheesed him. I'll put a video up about that. Um, I'd, I'd, I'd like to be able to sort of like uh, have a bit of a dignified fight with these bosses, but I'm not at that stage yet. But I want to continue through the levels because it's uh, nice to explore because it's such a beautiful game and it is a work of art. It is absolutely amazing. But anyway, you know, the more you play these games, uh, the better you get. I'm pretty, I'm pretty much new to the Souls-like games anyway, so I'm still learning. But they are a lot of fun. I don't think I'd like these types of games because I don't really like hard games. But uh, once you sort of get into the the way the combat system works, it is quite addictive. Well, very addictive. But also, like, the games are just so beautiful. Just amazing. So there we are. That's how to defeat the Leechmonger with a ranged weapon and the uh, longbow in this case. So you probably defeat him a lot quicker if you uh, do scale up your longbow rather than have a, you know, start a longbow with no um, leveling up on the weapon. So anyway, there we are. There's a leechmonger defeated. Job done. So I hope this helps out any rookies and people that get a bit frustrated and want to defeat uh, these bosses while they're still learning how to, um, you know, learn the patterns and learn how to defeat them on a melee attack. Anyway, I'm Waffling. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching and see you soon.